I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Why don't you Rebellio. cast Rebellio on this bust and see what details the field guide Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more Revelio. opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Rebellion. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Revelio. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. So many letters to write every day. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade 
as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now. As capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. 
More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Revelio. What are you up to now? There was something else too. A, a dash of powdered bat spleen, I think. that I don't write down. Now, you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Rebellion. Lumos. Protego. Revelio. Rebellion. Lumos. Protego. Revelio. If I'm what survives the reign of this headmaster, I think we should have a moon calf in charge. Revelio. Lumos. Protego.
Revelio. good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poachery. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with the basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a big opponent. As Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Levioso, go! Now, the basic cast. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel, using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. This should be easy. Protego! Protego? Levioso! Hastings. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. How's the view? You're good. Now perceptive. Thank you. Stupid one. This can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick love. I do enjoy a lively duel. Find all the nice students with us again. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. All right, that's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Revelio. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Nice work. I enjoyed that. 
Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Salo, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've jeweled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest jewel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned jeweling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck, or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Showing off is a muggle trait. You don't see that sort of behavior. If you know the right spell. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first. Rebellion. Use. Not anymore. And have you seen how these perform? I swear the man thinks I have fleas. You drilled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. I can appreciate Hogsmeade all year round. This is my sister's first year at Hogsmeade. Every time she pretends not to be here. Rebellion. Professor Rebellion. 
go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Someone said some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of... Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm. Accio, the last possible move. Eh, now, not to worry. Very good. Happens to the best of us. That's it. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new... Come on up! You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. I know everyone is watching, but try not to be nervous. You are doing quite well. Don't lose your composure. Let 
Excellent, but what's the Make this a bit more interesting, shall we? <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Hey, enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Be sharp. Good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. A tight game. It turns out we were evenly matched. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course. You can use Akio on humans. A if word so if you would. Well, you'd be using it on You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. You know it won't work I on trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? And what a close match between Thank you, Professor. I miss <clears throat> After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying Rebellion. everywhere. 
Quite unsafe, really. Hello. How was your first day coming along? Hello, Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a... Then isn't being hung here. Why it warrants looking in? Oh, watch the tile under your feet. You'll set off a. Revelio. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes. They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecat and Ronan. Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? Rigor in that. I'm not sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade, I meant we've. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your class. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a... Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed... I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a cake... He'll keep... Rookwood. A rather un... Once you've finished, Professor Roan, no time to wait. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The Mending Charm fixes things right up. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More free. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who... A number of your professors have... I have arranged... I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Professor, why must I complete these tasks? They are meant to give you first-hand experience as you proceed to master new bits of magic. Good luck, and I shall see you soon.
This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Revelio. Let me say. <laughs> Revelio. Lumos. Levioso. Let me say. Akio. Got it. Flying page must be around here somewhere. Only a new student would help me with that predicament. Might some kind of brilliant. If only a new student would help me with that I trust the preliminary tasks were I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Repair it. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? Nice to see you, my young friend.
like to see your parents face it when they see your marks at the end of term. Perhaps you should work on your polyjuice potion so you can pay them a visit as sharp and lie yourself silly about how marvelous you are and how you exceeded expectations. <laughs> My aunt has some potions that she she swears are from Sigmund Fudge himself. What? She wouldn't make it up. There's something in there I just love. Well, fancy meeting you here. Revelio. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. Is this your first? It is. Well, I... Hogsmeade's a char... I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Slytherin of course. Lucky, You're the only one who's ever best. Rebellion. Sure. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention. Accio! <laughs> spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Revelio! enough to keep me well rounded. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So, how did you manage to get on the Librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. Revelio! Stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient.
Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsby just past those ruins up ahead. Accio! Levioso! Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? A little? It's positively enormous. It is there. Accio! I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Revelio. I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Revelio. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys, ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A Demi guys, I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Rebellion!
Revelio. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Accio! Rebellion. My sister will be home for the holiday. Rebellion. Rebellion. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other... Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Rebellion. Revelio Accio Revelio Revelio Off on another adventure, are we? Revelio. Accio. Revelio. Lumos Accio Levioso Revelio 
Rebellion. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Revelio. Rebellion. Hello. Oh, come in. Come in. I'm sure of... But I showed them. But look at you. Looking for a change. I'm not sure what you mean, but I'm quite all right as I am. Some are going for that. But you won't find poisons here. No need for... Why don't you spend a moment choosing... What services do you offer? What is it you might be interested in? <laughs> 